Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Ilhan Omar makes scandalous claim about Trump as crowd erupts in massive protest. Ilhan Omar just got embarrassed on the streets of California when she was met with a massive block of protesters. She was giving a speech for care and Americans concerned with that organization's links to radicals came out in droves to be heard. From Breitbart, Rep. Ilhan Omar, DMN, spoke to a Council on American Islamic Relations CAIR, fundraiser in Woodland Hills, California, on Saturday evening and suggested that President Donald Trump was to blame for the recent terror attack against Muslims in New Zealand. According to audio obtained by the Gateway Pundit, Omar said, the reason I think that many of us knew that this was going to get worse is that we finally have a leader, a world leader in the White House, who publicly says Islam hates us, who fuels hate against Muslims, who thinks it is okay, that it's okay to speak about a faith and the whole community in a way that is dehumanizing, vilifying, and doesn't understand, or at least makes us want to think that he doesn't understand, the consequences that his words might have. Some people, like me, know that he understands the consequences. He knows that there are people that he can influence to threaten our lives, to diminish our presence, but what we know and what Islam teaches us, and what I always say, is that love trumps hate. From Fox News U.S. Representative Ilhan Omar faced hundreds of protesters Saturday outside a Southern California fundraising event for the local chapter of a major advocacy group representing Muslim Americans. Burn the Quran, Ilhan Omar, go to hell. And shame on you, terrorists were among some of the messages shouted outside a Woodland Hills hotel where the Minnesota Democrats spoke at a fundraiser for the Council of American Islamic Relations CAIR, of Greater Los Angeles, according to a report. The town is about 25 miles northwest of downtown LA. The protesters lined a sidewalk area, where they waved Israeli flags and denounced the freshman congresswoman over recent remarks that some have described as anti-Semitic, the Los Angeles Daily News reported. The atmosphere was a mix of dancing and music mixed with the vitriolic comments against Omar, the report said. A handful of counter-protesters also appeared outside the event to voice support for Omar. The event at the fourth annual Valley Banquet, titled Advancing Justice, Empowering Valley Muslims, was sold out and close to the public. The Los Angeles Police Department told City News Service that it had an unspecified number of officers working the event. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.